टॉपिक दैट वी स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम द लास्ट थ्री लेक्चर्स दैट वॉज रिलेटेड विदरेजिंग द इन्फॉर्मेशन सिस्टम and we are discussing the point information system development and the project management last time we have discussed what is been by the project then the project management etc etc before that we have discussed regarding the information system development and the phases in the development of information system etc and the first lecture of the third unit we have discussed regarding the what do you mean by the leveraging the information system and the uh, some of the important attribute of the project also last time we have discussed so project is what so what do you mean by the project last time we have discussed project is what yes what is been by the project yes tell me what is been by the project what is what is project and the what is project management Hmm. Yes, Akash. What is project? Don't know me. What do you mean by the project? Hmm. yes can't hear you uh, nirmal can't hear you properly yes yes anybody else mm -hmm. no can't hear you uh, yes anybody else what is mean by the project set of task project is nothing but the some sequential set, set of task and project management is what it involves planning and organization yes. to complete that set of task yeah. we need to perform and if you want to perform some set of task we need the some kind of planning and the organization planning and the organization of what planning and the organization of that resources we are going to utilize to complete that task for example in case of our software engineering field or in case of it computer field the resources we need to complete the projects are nothing but the hardware software resources then the employee as a human resource etc etc so last time we have studied the project management management is nothing but the planning and the organization of planning and the organization of some resources that we are going to utilize to complete the certain task and get the certain output okay now it is the whole responsibility of project manager to do the project management and complete the project within a certain specified or the decided time okay and to complete the project within a decided budget okay with the good quality of project these are all the things that need to be done by the project manager 
okay and so that is the reason the project management process is the most important thing when certain team along with the team manager is completing some project okay so today the important point that we are going to discuss is nothing but the what is the need of project management okay and to answer this question we are having this following reasons we are the following these reasons which gives us the idea why there is a need of project management there are the some few reasons that we are going to discuss today okay which give us the idea why there is a increased need related with the project management or efficient and the effective management of the project okay in that the first reason we have here you can see the first reason for that is the for the need of the project management is nothing but to control the scope of project and the managing the change so you tell me what do you mean by the scope of the project yes what do you mean by the scope of the project yes project ji kay value asa वैल्यू नाही वैल्यू स्कोप आपण काय म्हणतो जनरली स्कोप वर्ड यूज करतो आपण स्कोप म्हणजे काय डिमांड इन द मार्केट टू द डिमांड इन द मार्केट बरोबर आता इथं स्कोप आपला इथं हियर यू हॅव टू टेक द मीनिंग ऑफ द स्कोप ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट एज व्हॉट व्हॉट यूजर आर एक्सपेक्टिंग यूजर इन द सेंस द कस्टमर व्हॉट कस्टमर्स आर एक्सपेक्टिंग रिलेटेड विथ दॅट प्रोजेक्ट what kind of functionality that customer is expecting from that project so that is the scope of the project what functionality that project should provide okay so that the first reason is what related with the project management need of the project managers to control the scope of the project and manage the change to control the scope of the project in the sense that project should provide the, all the functionality that project should able to perform all the roles that is being expected by the customer of that particular project understood now initially when the project request come consider you are you you uh, you are uh, working in some project when some project request come okay initially what users are expecting from that project customer are expecting from that project that everything we collect this in the form of the requirement i hope you are remembering the requirement phase okay first phase so initially we collect together all the requirements from the that particular customer when the customer gives the project request to certain company so that is nothing but the initiation of the project okay but it might happen uh, after some times when the project development is going on the changes being demanded by some customer it might happen between the projects when the project development is going on the customer might ask to that uh, company or to that uh, team manager to make some changes it can happen or not yes when now project yes. request is given yes. to the particular company and team particular team manager and the members of the team are working on that project but after some times the customer feels he need to add some more functionality he need to make some changes in that project so he can demand the changes yes or no yes sir so as i said the customer can demand some small changes in the project so the customer we are also calling the customer as a main stakeholder of that project also owner of the project correct yes sir also management of that particular company might they also need to make some changes they can also ask to that team manager and the employees of that team to make some changes okay or project team itself they might be expecting some changes need to be done when the project development is going on so these changes has to be accepted by that project manager and the team members okay 
and accordingly now when some changes come as i said during the initiation of the project we used to finalize what we used to finalize what is the what is the amount of time that will be required to complete that project what will be the budget required to the project so initially we used to finalize all these things yes or no yes sir but in between develop when the development of project is going on as i as we are discussing customer or the stakeholders or the management may ask to do some changes now in that case in that case there is a importance of the project management yes or no because in that case the manager has to make some changes in the schedule of the project yes or no yes sir we take the simple example suppose uh, after two days you are going to appear for your oral exam okay and initially i told you you have to prepare the two units for your oral but at the one day before your oral exam i told you that the you need to prepare the three units you you are getting the situation yes sir then what you will do you will utilize that one day remaining okay and you try to prepare for the three units yes or no yes sir so that management is that that kind of management is done by yourself only correct related to the preparation of the extra unit that management is done by whom yourself correct yes sir so that is nothing but the situation here so when the some in between the development of project is going on some customer or the stakeholder or the management asked to do some changes now that changes has to be acceptable by the team manager team management and the particular employees who are working in that team and as the changes has come they need to make the changes in the schedule of the project as well as they need to make some changes in the budget of the project so they need to make the changes in such a way that the project will be get deliver within a stipulated schedule stipulated in the sense the schedule which was decided initially correct or not असं व्हायला नको असं व्हायला नको की प्रोजेक्ट डिलिव्हरीचा आपण इनिशियली तीन महिन्याचा टाइम डिसाइड केला होता बरोबर किती तीन महिन्याचा ओके अँड इन बिटवीन आफ्टर वन मंथ द चेंजेस हॅज कम फ्रॉम द कस्टमर नीड दे नीड टू मेक द सम चेंजेस सो इट शुड नॉट हॅपन दॅट थ्री मंथ टाइम विल गेट इन्क्रीज टू द फोर मंथ टाइम असं असं होणं योग्य आहे का सांगा मला नो so that is the management there the project manager project manager has to do the management ki ata thik hai apan 3 mahine agodar decide kela hota vel pan ata in between kay jala aplya customer kadun new requirements alya tari sudha it is the role of the team manager to complete that changes and to complete the scope of the project within how many months within a 3 months only so in order to do that what what thing has to be done by the team manager team manager might increase the hours of the working of that employee correct yes sir just like i told you the example of two units and the three units if i just before the one day exam just before the one day of the exam i i told you there will be the three units so you need to you need to increase your hours of the study correct yes sir yes, so same thing is nothing but the management okay and that is nothing but the need of the project management and the first reason in that is nothing but to control the scope of the project and to manage the changes that happening in the project understood the first reason yes sir okay second important reason related with the need uh, uh, related with the need for the project management is as you can see here okay this already we have discussed okay second is to deliver the project on time and within a budget okay so whatever the time has been decided initially whatever the budget has been decided initially 
within that time and within that budget only the project has to be get deliver as as i as i said if the three months is being decided okay and if the project cost is being decided as a four lakhs okay so within this particular three months and using this budget of four lakhs only the project delivery must happen okay now this these two factors project delivery within a time and within a budgets generally affect on the kind of return the kind of profit the company used to get after completion of the project because what happened the project manager and the project management team they used to do some calculation initially what they what they used to do some calculation what kind of calculation the calculation is like this roi roi stands for the return on the investment what do you mean by the return on the investment return on the investment means what roi return on the investment yes the project management used to do the cash cost calculation such as the return on the investment जस्ट लाइक हियर एज आई सेड कि बजेट अपन कितने प्रोजेक्ट फॉर एक्साम्पल फोर लैक्स मीन दिस इज द बजेट गिवन टू द कस्टमर कि तुम्हारा चार लाख रुपये हाथ प्रोजेक्ट सा लगते हैं चार लाख मध्य कैलक्युलेशन कि इन्वेस्टमेंट फॉर एक्जाम्पल अपन धरू किसी थ्री लैक्स गॉट द पॉइंट इन्वेस्टमेंट कि थ्री लैक्स इन्वेस्टमेंट कि एम्प्लॉई सा uh the payment of the employee then the uh, cost required for the various resources cost resource cost required for the manpower etc etc ki sagli kay jali investment kiti 3 lakhs you got the point ani yacha varche je plus 1 lakh he jala company cha kay profit getting the point yes sir okay so he calculation company kadi karte ki ja vela tanla project request the they got the project request and then they send the approval to the customer that time they used to decide all these things that is the this calculation that is the return on the investment ata return on the investment ite kiti hai ki 1 lakh okay for example we are considering now in order to get this return on the investment the particular company need to deliver the project within a decided time and within a decided budget if there is a late in the delivery of the project it might affect on the kind of return they are used to get from that investment is it can happen or not if the project delivery time decided 3 months and company give the delivery after the 4 months will it affect on the return the company will get after the delivery of the project yes or no yeah yes how it can how it can affect yes suraj how it can affect on the return that company will get sir employees uh, cost pan vadel and sir the profitable ne ranar cost asha asha cost asha mule vadel ki je kaam tumhi 3 mahina madhe karaycha tharvalo hota te tumhi kaam ata kiti mahina madhe karta hai 4 mahina madhe इतर एम्प्लॉई एम्प्लॉई ला तुम्हाला ती एम्प्लॉई कॉस्ट वाढली यस ऑर नो यस सर इफ द एम्प्लॉई कॉस्ट इंक्रीज प्रॉफिट विल डिक्रीज ऑल ऑफ यू आर एग्री यस सर एंड दैट इज द रीजन इट इज मस्ट रिक्वायरमेंट दैट प्रोजेक्ट डिलीवरी मस्ट हैपन विद इन अ टाइम एंड विद इन अ बजेट अंडरस्टूड इवन इफ सम चेंजेस हैज टू बी डन इन बिटवीन दैट पीरियड so uh, for this reason the project management is must there there is a need of the project management the same thing i have written here once roi is established or decided it is the role of the project manager to ensure that the project schedule and project budget adhere to adhere to in the sense it will not get changed adhere to it else the project will fail to deliver the expected result and the expected 
return so next important second important reason is nothing but to delivery of the project in the time and within a budget to do this to be the delivery of the project in time and with with within a decided budget the that the, this thing is very important that is doing the project management and who is doing this the project manager understood the second reason yes sir next important to ensure the focus of the project team this is the most important nowadays to ensure the focus of the project team can anybody tell me about this to ensure the focus of the project team if some of your relatives are working in the software company you can ask to them whether they are allowed to utilize facebook whatsapp twitter this kind of social sites on their working on their working site on the working their on on working on their laptop or the computer you know about this are they are they are allowed to do use these things no sir no why sir je ate samjha project over tarli sir the time spent project par jala pe 100% ha tar de ase use karal dile tar te employee kay kartil whatsapp par khelat bastil kiwa twitter facebook they are it can happen or not it is a natural thing correct yes sir so to make the employee to focus tumhi sudha kay tumchi jave exam chalu aste you do what you make your time table and you used to stick that time table in your study room kasha sathi karta tumhi yes tumhi kay karta ek tumche exam tumche study se ek time table banavta banavta ka tumhi that is the first thing exam cha kala madhe tumhi study se time table banavta ka yes yes sir why 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 you are doing that yes why you are doing that hmm suraj why you are doing that सर स्टडी वेळेवर कंप्लीट झाला पाहिजे वेळेवर कंप्लीट तुमचं लक्ष दुसरीकडे विचलित होता कामा नाही तुम्ही जर त्या रूम मध्ये गेला तुमच्या स्टडी रूम मध्ये जर तुमचं लक्ष त्या टाइम टेबल वर गेल्यानंतर तुम्हाला काल पाहिजे अरे आपली वी आर आवर एग्जाम इज कमिंग इन द फ्यू डेज सो वी शुड फोकस ऑन व्हाट वी शुड फोकस ऑन द स्टडी द सेम थिंग इज हियर टू एन्श्योर द फोकस ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट टीम द प्रोजेक्ट मॅनेजर हॅज टू डू द मॅनेजमेंट अँड ही कॅन नाव आय टोल्ड यू द एक्झाम्पल so the all the things which can distract the attention of this team members from doing the project work that all the things are avoided in the software company so it is common for the project team to drift the to drift from the main task and spend the unnecessary longer time on the other tasks so it can happen that employee might spend their time on other task instead of spending the time on doing the project work it can happen or not it can happen or not employee of the employee of that particular uh, uh, team who are working on some project if they are allowed to utilize these all the things that social site etc they might spend more time on that social site instead of working on the project it can happen or not yes sir it happens now it is the responsibility of whom to ensure that such kind of thing should not happen it is the responsibility of whom asa ho na yacha sathi responsibility kona chi team leader team leader or the project manager so it is the responsibility of project manager to ensure that the project team focus on the right task by using the clear and the concise project charter project charter in the sense the project schedule is being made ani tya project charter or kiwa project chart or kay ki aaj cha divshi kay task complete karayche ye project chi udya kay complete karayche like this the chart is being maintained to to complete the work of every day so that employee can see that and complete their work instead of spending the time on some other unnecessary work 
so that is nothing but the third reason for which the project management is required and that third reason is what to ensure the focus of the project team got this point yes sir focus should not be go away from the doing the project work to other work so to ensure that there is a requirement or there is a need to do the project management and it is done by whom the project manager okay let's see the fourth important point for which the project management is required to do that is to collect the user requirement from the disparate sources what is this what is the fourth reason to collect the user requirement from disparate sources means what म्हणजे सर युजर च्या रिक्वायरमेंट्स काय काय आहे युजर च्या ज्या रिक्वायरमेंट आहेत त्या इनिशियली आपण काय केलं त्या टीम मॅनेजरने किंवा त्या टीम मधील जे लोक एम्प्लॉई काम करत आहेत दे शुड कलेक्ट द रिक्वायरमेंट फ्रॉम द युजर फॉर दॅट रिझन ऑल्सो देर इज अ नीड ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट मॅनेजमेंट वाय इट इज रिक्वायर्ड टू कलेक्ट द युजर रिक्वायरमेंट्स ड्युरिंग द इनिशियल फेज बिकॉज आफ्टर सम टाइम्स इट माईट हॅपन it might happen that project the that particular customer will say that i have not asked you to do this and you have done this so in order to avoid this task or customer might say i have asked you to add this function but you have not added this function is this kind of things happen or not yes sir that is called as the future descent that is called as what the future descent between user and the that particular project team descent in the sense what matbed you are getting the point descent manje kay matbed matbed kadi hou shaktat tya project team madhe ani ha yes sir manje user che requirements tan je tachan viruddha tala kay bhet त्यांनी जे सांगितलं ते जर त्याला दिसलं नाही की त्या प्रोजेक्ट मध्ये लाईक बिकॉज ऑफ दॅट थिंग्स वॉट हॅपन देअर माईट बी अट कॅन से द डिसेंट हॅपन बिटवीन द प्रोजेक्ट टीम अँड दॅट पर्टिक्युलर कस्टमर मग याच्यासाठी काय की युजली याच्यासाठी काय केलं जातं की इनिशियली द कॉन्ट्रॅक्ट इज मेड बिटवीन द प्रोजेक्ट दॅट पर्टिक्युलर कंपनी अँड द कस्टमर कॉन्ट्रॅक्ट आय होप यू आर गेटिंग द मिनिंग ऑफ कॉन्ट्रॅक्ट येस कॉन्ट्रॅक्ट मीन्स वॉट एक करार करार म्हणतो आपण त्याला करार केला जातो कुणामध्ये ते प्रोजेक्ट टीम मॅनेज हु इज गोइंग टू डू दॅट प्रोजेक्ट अँड द कस्टमर आणि त्याच्यामध्ये सगळ्या गोष्टी मेन्शन केल्या जातात की रिक्वायरमेंट काय असणार आहे प्रोजेक्ट कधी कम्प्लीट होणार आहे बजेट किती असणार आहे ह्या सगळ्या गोष्टी ऍज अ युजर रिक्वायरमेंट आर बिंग टेकन फ्रॉम द युजर ओके इन ऑर टू डू दिस देर इज अ नीड ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट मॅनेजमेंट understand the second uh, fourth reason yes sir the same thing i have mentioned here the advantage of collecting the input from various sources various sources in the sense main source of main source related with the project here is what the customer itself the primary advantage of collecting the input from various sources is that the project manager is able to avoid the future descent from user and is able to communicate the project benefit so for that purpose there is a need to collect the user requirement fifth important reason to communicate the project progress risk and the changes tell me about this the fifth reason for which there is a need of the project management that is what to communicate the project progress risk and changes what is this म्हणजे सर प्रोजेक्ट प्रोजेक्ट च्या रिलेटेड अपडेट वगैरे म्हणजे प्रोजेक्ट वर्क प्रोजेक्ट चे किती कम्प्लिशन झालंय बरोबर इज देअर एनी डिफिकल्टी इन कम्प्लिटिंग द फंक्शनॅलिटी दॅट इज बीन आस्क बाय द कस्टमर जर कस्टमरने काही चेंजेस सांगितले असतील तर त्याच्या रिलेटेड अपडेट्स ह्या सगळ्या गोष्टी इन ऑर्डर टू कम्युनिकेट ऑल दिस थिंग्स विथ कस्टमर 
or with the stakeholder stakeholder in the sense owner of that project there is a need of the project management you got the point to communicate with who to communicate with whom to communicate with the stakeholder of the project and who is the stakeholder of the project yes who is the stakeholder of the project user manje user customer that is nothing but the Come owner on. owner is the main stakeholder of the project the same thing i have mentioned the stakeholder of the project need to be kept updated on the project progress hurdles in the like the difficulties that or might occur in the project or changes that has done in the project so in order to do all these things there is a need of the project management the same thing i have mentioned every good project management plan has a communication plan has a communication plan and that communication has to be happen with whom that communication has to be happen with the stakeholder of that particular project to avoid any communication issue understand the fifth reason yes sir yes why shall i understand the fifth reason to do the project management yes let's move to the next that is the six to prepare for the unexpected project related issue to prepare for the unexpected project related issue also there is a need of the project management can you give the example for this reason yes any good example for this to prepare for the unexpected project related issue yes vaishali what do you mean by this to prepare for the unexpected project related issues nahi mai sir yes anybody unexpected project related issue means what unexpected in the sense mhanje je hava nahuta sir aplyala je achanak tumcha pude yeu shakta ashi gosht asha adchani like now suppose you have given the project request before the this corona pandemic understood the situation what you have given the project request before this corona pandemic okay and after that the corona pandemic started now after that you know the lockdown has happened correct yes sir yes sir then is it, is it the unexpected issue or situation yes sir yes now in order to address this unexpected issue or the situation there is a need of the alternate plan yes sir in order to have this alternate plan there is a need of the project management yes sir an alternate plan can you be, you can see the number of companies are now working from the home related to the software company i am telling correct yes sir now i am i am telling you the corona as one example there can be another things like flood situation barobar pur sthiti jali bangalore madhe jalo the in the last year or the in the previous year uh, uh, just year uh, i think 2019 there was a flood situation no employee were able to go to the office so that is the kind of unexpected issues or there can be the technical issues also related with the project now in order to handle these issues there is a need of what alternate planning the plan b yes or no yes sir and this is these things then because of that there is a need of the project management and as to the sixth one yes yes sir and the last one is nothing but to document the knowledge gain from the project for this also there is a need of the project management what do you mean by this to document the knowledge gain from the project yes what do you mean 
वर्किंग ऑन दैट प्रोजेक्ट एवरीबडी यूज टू गेन सम नॉलेज एवरीबडी यूज टू गेन सम एक्सपीरियंस अंडरस्टूड सो दैट एवरीथिंग हैज टू बी डॉक्यूमेंटेड इन द फॉर्म ऑफ सम रिपोर्ट गॉट द पॉइंट understood yes, project report is different and document this knowledge that experience they have got is the different understood yes or no yes sir ki to project kartana tanna kay anubhavle kay navin goshti te sik that employee has learned that everything that is being referred as the documented experience he kasha sathi for what purpose why it is need to be done Yes. What What do you think? Why it is need to be done? Sir, my next another project will be helpful. Exactly. That new project that you are related to Kerala Jal Pude. So, the first thing you have to do is you need you get some guidance from this documented experience, and that also for this reason also there is a need to do the project management. Understood the seventh reason. Yes, sir. Okay, very good. Last point here that is nothing but the feasibility. That is the uh, which is being also referred as the project feasibility. Now, what do you mean by the project feasibility? Yes, anybody can tell me. What do you mean by the feasibility study? Hmm. What do you mean by the feasibility study or the project feasibility? now in ge in general meaning of feasibility is the possibility what possibility i hope you are getting the meaning of possibility possibility means what ho sakta sir yes here here gosht apan karu shakto ki nahi can these things happen from us or not can we able to complete this or not that is nothing but the feasibility or the possibility and here now there are there is this is the very important point related with the project uh, related to the project that is the project feasibility now what exactly this project feasibility and when actually it is done now project feasibility study or the feasibility study is done preliminary it is done as a preliminary study preliminary study in the sense it is done at the first phase of our project only what is our first phase of project analysis yes or no yes sir requirement and that time only this kind of study is being conducted or this kind of study is being done now what exactly this study now project feasibility or the feasibility study determine the validity of the project what it does determine the validity of the project now what do you mean by the determining the validity of the project okay what we are discussing the project feasibility or the feasibility study when the feasibility study is get done yes when the project feasibility study is get done during the mid, at the middle of the project or after finishing of the project or during the initiation of the project when when the project feasibility study is done during the initiation during the middle of the project or after finishing of the project when during initiation during the initiation of the project and what is actually done in the feasibility study the validity of project is being get determined now what exactly mean by the validity of the project that we are discussing okay now validity of the project is nothing but doing the analysis of the project relevant factor or doing the analysis related with the different factors of the project now which factors of the project economic factor of the project technical factor of the project legal factor of the project and scheduling factor of the project doing the analysis of all this factor doing the analysis of all this factor is nothing but called as the project feasibility study and that is nothing but the 
determining the validity of the project now what exactly this factor first factor is what economic factor now what can be the economic factor what can be the technical factor what can be the legal factor and what can be the scheduling factor yes let's discuss what do you think first is the economic factor means what feasibility related with the economic factor economic factor cha related shakyata padtaalun pahane that is the one factor in the feasibility study now what do you mean by the economic factor economic factor in the sense what if our company does this project will company will get profit from doing this project getting yes sir will our company get the profit from doing this project will this project will get completed within a decided budget correct yes sir so these things comes under the economic factor and this is the one of the factor in doing the feasibility study first factor understood then technical factor what do you mean by the technical then think just like economic factor we have decided ki apan ha project kela tar to ja budget madhe decide kela to ya budget madhe complete hoil ka ani complete jari dala tar aplya company la tyacha varun kay profit hoil ka these factors thinking on this factor that is the economic factor technical factor what is the technical factor is this the technical factor if i tell you the company has to think on whether our company has the employee with that particular skill with that particular technical skill with that particular programming skill using which this project can be get completed whether our company is having that kind of hardware and the software technical technology using which this project can be get completed is this the technical factor yes sir exactly understood so that is the second legal factor legal factor कि तो प्रोजेक्ट तुम्हें एक्सेप्ट के ठीक है पो प्रोजेक्ट करना ही कुछ इलिगल गोष्ट कि नहीं एवरी सॉफ्टवेयर प्रोजेक्ट इज द लीगल नो सर नो मै कि वेदर द प्रोजेक्ट यू आर डूइंग इज इट द लीगल और नॉट आई होप यू आर गेटिंग द मीनिंग ऑफ लीगल एंड द इलिगल यस सर and last important factor scheduling factor ki ha jo project tumhe accept karta hai in order to complete that project whether that project will get complete within a decided time or not correct yes sir so analysis and study of all this factor is nothing but the feasibility study and it is nothing but the project feasibility this question can be asked for the two marks or the four marks understood yes sir same thing i have mentioned here now feasibility study has to done by the project manager along with its team and that in the doing that project uh, feasibility study project manager also need to study what are the advantages benefits and the disadvantage the benefits of undertaking this project or doing this project what are the whether the money that you are investing time that you are investing according to that whether company will receive the return on that yes or no that is also the part of the project feasibility study done by the project manager as well as doing this project feasibility study the project manager has to give the information to the company management that if you are doing this project is there any business risk is there any business risk in doing that particular project business risk can come when you are doing some illegal project 
yes or no business risk can come when you do some illegal projects it can happen or not yes sir so these all the things all the things has to be studied in the project feasibility study okay same point i have mentioned here it is uh, project feasibility study is being done to ensure that the organization is on the right track and focusing on the right problem the organization is not focusing on any illegal problem or the wrong problem it is solving the right problem for the customer these all the things are come under the project feasibility also feasibility study tell the management so project that team man, uh, team manager of that particular project the, he has also tell to the management that this project we can easily do we can solve this particular project we can solve this particular problem which we have received from the customer project is also consider as a one problem yes or no can we call the project as one problem until it not get completed yes sir barobar na jyavesh tumhala project request yete त्यावेळेस जर तुम्ही प्रोजेक्ट मध्ये काम करत असाल तर तो तुमच्यासाठी एक प्रॉब्लेम आहे यू आर गेटिंग आणि तुम्हाला त्याच्यावर काम करायचं यू हॅव टू सॉल्व दॅट प्रॉब्लेम इन द सेन्स यू हॅव टू कम्प्लीट दॅट प्रोजेक्ट अंडरस्टूड सो दीज ऑल द थिंग्स ऑल्सो गेट रिफ्लेक्टेड इन द रिटर्न ऑन द इन्व्हेस्टमेंट सो डुईंग द इकॉनॉमिक स्टडी इज ऑल्सो इंडिकेशन ऑफ वॉट डुईंग द स्टडी ऑफ रिटर्न ऑन द इन्व्हेस्टमेंट सो स्टडिंग ऑल दीज फॅक्टर्स दॅट फोर फॅक्टर दॅट आय जस्ट वी हॅव जस्ट discuss here like what is the first factor economic second technical third legal and the scheduling so study of all this factor is nothing but the project feasibility is it the required thing that need to be done what do you think is it the required thing yes or no Yes, sir. What do you think? Whether the feasibility study need to be done or not? Yes, sir. Definitely, it is the compulsory thing that need to be done. Okay, during the project management. I hope all of you understood this point. Yes. yes sir okay so that's it from today's lecture okay i'm concluding now thank you all of you thank you sir